This week we are talking all about our grandbot mom. It means large feeding. So this is typically the final thing that we do at the bar, which means we're almost to the finish line. And so when we go to do our grand batmas, I will often have our dancers again starting first when they are first learning them. And our goal is to do a clean grand batma to a 90 degree angle before we go higher. Now, for some dancers who are really tight in like their hamstrings or really clenching in their quads, the ground bot mom may actually be a little bit lower. The reason I say this is because ideally we want this to be at 90, but we don't want to see hips lifting or our backs being thrown into it. So a ground bot ma simply goes up and beats down to close. The accent should be on the closing, as with any kind of batma. So it's beat. It can go to the front, and it can go to the side, can go to the back, and again to the side. My younger dancers will do this face in the bar in which case we go to the front, to the side, to the back, and to the side. By holding the bar, this allows us to keep our shoulders square over our ribs and square over our hips. Our level dancers are required to wear an alignment band to make sure that we have the sandwich effect occurring and keeping our alignment where it belongs. Be sure to check back tomorrow as we talk about some of our closing options for our Grand Bot Ma, such as being in first, fifth, or even to the Point Tendu. I will see you tomorrow.